We've been drawn together this day to witness and commemorate Chris and Morgan. They're founding among us a new home. All of the friends and the family that have gathered here today, they love you. That's why they came tonight. The past two years have been the happiest of my life. I have never known joy like I've experienced with you. The love and support you have given me is unparalleled and I know that together we can make it through anything. I look forward to a lifetime with you because I have never known love like the love I have for you. I think we're going to have a wonderful life together. You are the love of my life, my best friend. I'm the most wonderful I have ever met. <laughs> I thank God every day for bringing you into my life, and I consider myself the luckiest man in the world because I have you. I love you so much, and I cannot wait to marry you today. Love, Chris. Chris, today I get to marry the man of my dreams. Every day I wonder how I got to be so lucky with you. Every day I wake up excited because there's another day I get to have an adventure with you. You're the most incredible man I've ever met. You're hardworking and provide for me. You are so kind and patient with me. You are so intelligent and witty. The two years I have been with you have changed my life drastically. You make me want to be a better person and provide me with such a sense of security and stability. When I think about how much I love you, it hurts my heart. We have such an amazing life ahead of us. I get to be by your side for every step of it. As soon as I walk down the aisle and get to marry you again, I would do this every day for the rest of my life if I could. I love you so much, Chris. You're absolutely the man of my dreams. I can't wait for this next adventure with you. Love you.
So Chris, Morgan said that she most admires your intelligence, your work ethic, your selflessness, how loving you are, your sense of humor, how you stand up for the little guy and for what is right, your kindness. And she said she could just go on and on and on. Morgan Chris said that he most admires your intelligence, the fact that you are jovial and fun to be around, your humor, the way you care about others, the way you love, and just the patience that you exemplify day after day. But you see, through marriage, there is only one thing that's going to be able to sustain you through the good times and through the bad times, and that is placing the foundation of your marriage on the rock of Jesus Christ. I, Chris, take you, Morgan, to be my wedded wife, to be my wedded wife, to have and to hold, to have and to hold, from this day forward, from this day forward, for better or for worse, for better or for worse, for richer or poor, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish you, to love and to cherish you, as long as we both shall live, as long as we both shall live. I, Morgan, take you, Chris. I, Morgan, take you, Chris. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish you. To love and to cherish you. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Christopher McCartney. I just want to say, Morgan, what, what a special daughter you've been, and what a beautiful woman you've turned out to be. I, you're just gorgeous, and I, I couldn't have picked a better man for you. You did a great job. <laughs> 